How's it going guys and welcome back. In this video we're going to be checking out the best method to farm Hornetor materials in Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak DLC. So the Hornetors are small monsters that many people are having a lot of trouble to find as they are quite rare and they only appear in the two new areas, in the jungle and in the citadel. So there's actually a very good method to farm a bunch of these, literally as many as you need, very, very quickly. At some point during your early progression of Master Rank 1, which means this can be done very, very close to the start of the Sunbreak DLC, you'll find a Master Rank 1 quest called Buggin' Out. The Buggin' Out quest will send us to the jungle to slay a total of 20 Vespoid or Hornet Horse. The great thing about this is that during this quest, it will spawn in a bunch of Hornet Horse into jungle that aren't usually there on a regular expedition. During this quest, not only is there going to be a bunch of them, they're also going to be shown as red dots on the map if you check. It is true the dots can indicate either Vespoids or Hornetors, so you're not guaranteed for them all to be Hornetors, but there's about half of each, so if you just go around doing all the red dots, you should have a bunch of these. Plus, they actually respawn during the same expedition, so you don't really have to back out until you've killed 20 of them. So with this, you can farm as many of the Hornetor materials as you need. So there you have it, guys. That is the best method to farm these materials. I hope you guys are enjoying the DLC. So anyway, I hope you did find this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to thumbs up button, subscribe for more content coming very soon, and we'll see you next time.